Hi, Dina. I put together this short video audit of your listing on Amazon, and it's my hope that I'll earn a phone call with you. My name is Sean, and I'm with the Seller Central Marketing Agency, My Amazon Guy. So look, I've got your quart size uh, bags pulled up right here. Now, before we go through the listing, one of the first things I like to do is take a peek behind the scenes. So I grabbed your ace in here and loaded it into helium tin. So let's go take a look. All right, here we go. Let's get me out of the way. Now within Helium 10, I see you have 837 sponsored keywords and just under 1300 organic keywords. So curious how this mix is performing for you. We like to see depending on the category, but within this one, a one to two ratio. So for every one sponsored, you have two organic. So let's scroll down though, and let's see how you're performing within your keywords. So your highest organic rank is one gallon bags, which is good. Um, all right. And then looking here, not a lot of, not a lot of search traffic within those. Let's look at your sponsored keywords and see how those are performing. Here we go. Click on that. Should have clicked on that earlier. Sorry, <laughs> but we want to see more search traffic within your sponsored keywords. All right. Food storage bags, court Ziploc bags, gallon storage, Okay, but see, that's got the, the K, so I think people aren't searching with that as much. So yeah, not some here, but not a lot of search traffic. So I know it's a competitive category. Let's see currently what keywords are being used the most within this category. Okay, dog food and thinking of storage for that. Ziploc bag storage organizer. No, Ziploc bags. Wow. So this one, I swore I would have seen you here. Food storage even. And in the i mean your your page is deep here it's gonna okay so clearly you see within the the top searched keywords you're either pages deep you're never going to be at, you know within this on the top of the the ranking as a matter of fact let's look at your sponsored keywords i mean maybe just a handful of times you'll you'll be number one so interesting but let's go back to your listing i know search and pay-per-click. It's not set it and forget it. You've always got to work it. So back here to your listing. So I want to scroll down here. It looks like you've got six images. Okay. So this is obviously the first image you got to put on there. I wonder if there's a way where you can make this a little more apparent. I mean, you can see it here in these images, but on that first image, curious if, if, you know, maybe if you had the box, you know, what kind of package does it come in? Something behind it, you know, where you can see the date and contents. Because when I first looked at this listing, I didn't know you could write on these bags. I think that's fantastic. Um, I like that. So, I, you know, I've seen bags similar to this. And then over here, all right. So, and here we go. We've got the, the thickness and the measurements of it. So interesting. I would add video and more images like this. Um, possibly look at breaking up your first image. Again, I didn't know you can write on it. I think that's a big selling value. Um, you know, maybe something behind the image to break it apart from the white. Now your title is good. It is very long. Um, you can have upwards of 200 characters, but you've got a lot of punctuation in here that's not necessary. I would take that out and, you know, maybe look to add another word if you could. Now, as we scroll down, I see you've got your, your uh, parentage here. So it looks like, okay, I, I think I clicked on this earlier. So you've got the gallon size bags where they can get 250 of them there. Oh, and you've only got seven left in stock. And then you've got the quart size bags here. So interesting. Um, I love the parentage, by the way. Continue doing that. And then as we scroll down, you did a good job with your five bullets. So, um, you know, the, the one recommendation I would make here would be on this image and then more images like this, possibly video too, to see the bags opening, closing. That video is very, very beneficial on Amazon. Um, and then scrolling down, I want to take a peek at your branding down here. Well, you don't have anything. Oh, that's unfortunate. Now I looked at, because I know you've also got breast milk uh, containers and I looked there and if I remember correctly, you had some branding here. Okay. Scrolling down. Okay. Yeah, you do have branding. So let's look at this while we're here. Um, oh, and okay. So I'm curious if you're, if you're changing the names or what, cause this is zip it all. 
and that is not the, the bag, the other bag was called. So I want to look real quick since I'm on your listing here, look at your alt text. So brand name, breast milk, breast milk storage bags. So you've got a little duplication there, secure storage, resealable, freezer safe, food safe storage. You've got a lot of repetition here. Okay, more repetition. Okay, more repetition. So think about, you know, the keywords that we saw. Um, and I know this is a different type of bag, but your your alt text behind your images uh, has got a lot of duplication um, in it. So I would absolutely update that and fix that. Let's go back though to your bag while, while we have it here. So back on the bag. I just want to show you an example, and I'm sure you've seen this. This is the number two selling um, plastic storage or disposable storage here. I didn't want to go on to Amazon's, but this is the number two selling uh, storage bag on Amazon quart size. And if you look here, they've got their six images, you know, clear. You can see they've got video even, parentage. But look at this branding they did down here, right? You can't go wrong with this branding. This is shown to increase your average order value. It drives organic traffic, which equates to a higher conversion ratio. And I just want to show you one last example, not to compare your listing product, but just to look at this listing. We put it together for a company called Age of Sage. It's a box set of four bars of men's soap. You see they've got six images, two videos, they've got a long title, parentage, tons of text here. But remember, this was a box set of men's soap. And as you scroll down, made by the Age of Sage, look at this branding, right? Age of Sage. You see, they're far more than just that men's soap. They have, you know, women's soap. They've got wine tumblers. They've got body creams and um, bath bombs, incense and smudge sticks. Look at this branding here, you know, even further in the uh the above also told their story right scrolling down the look at all this content on this listing and this has helped drive traffic increase their organic ranking and then as you scroll down they've got a product grid which has shown to increase your average order value so listen i know i packed a lot of information dina in this short video it's my hope that i earned that phone call go ahead and click the link in my email that reads book a call It'll open up my schedule where you can snag yourself a free 30 minute consultation. And if you do it soon, I may be able to get our founder, Stephen Pope on the line with us. But hey, thanks so much for watching and I look forward to speaking with you soon. Take care.